What if the Megalodon, the largest shark that ever lived, was hiding in the Mariana Trench? Let's dive into this mystery. The Mariana Trench, located in the Western Pacific, is the deepest point of our world's oceans. It plunges down an astounding 11 kilometers below the surface, more than Mount Everest's height if inverted. This abyssal depth is shrouded in perpetual darkness, intense pressure and chilling cold, making it a realm of enigmatic creatures and unsolved mysteries. Now imagine the Megalodon, a behemoth of the prehistoric seas. It was roughly 18 meters long, three times the size of the largest great white shark. This enormous predator ruled the warm coastal waters around the globe millions of years ago, feasting on whales and other large marine mammals. The Mariana Trench and the Megalodon are both captivating subjects on their own. But what if they were connected? Imagine this enormous creature lurking in the dark abyss of the Mariana Trench. Before we dive deeper, let's get to know the Megalodon. This colossal creature was no ordinary shark. The Megalodon or Big Tooth as its name suggests, was a true titan of the deep, reaching lengths of up to 18 meters almost three times the size of a great white shark. Its diet? Almost anything it wanted. From giant squids to prehistoric whales nothing was off the menu for this monstrous marine predator. It ruled the oceans during the Miocene and Pliocene eras, between 23 and 2.6 million years ago, asserting its dominance as an apex predator. The Megalodon was a true force of nature, a predator that instilled fear into the hearts of all marine life. Its teeth, the size of a human hand could tear into flesh with ease, making it one of the most formidable hunters the world has ever seen. With its formidable size and predatory nature the Megalodon was truly a terror of the seas. Now let's explore the Mariana Trench the deepest part of the world's oceans. This abyssal chasm reaching a maximum depth of about 11 kilometers is a world of darkness and pressure. The sun's rays cannot penetrate these depths, leaving it in perpetual night. The pressure here is over a thousand times greater than at sea level, akin to having 50 jumbo jets piled on top of you. The temperature in the Mariana Trench hovers just above freezing, around 1 to 4 degrees Celsius. It's a hostile environment, uninviting and unforgiving, yet life has found a way. From tiny microbes to giant amphipods, organisms here have adapted to survive. Take for instance the fangtooth fish. Its large, needle-like teeth and pressure-resistant body make it a formidable predator in this deep-sea environment. Or, consider the snailfish, a creature that thrives in the cold, crushing depths. Its gelatinous body can withstand the extreme pressure and it feeds on tiny crustaceans that fall from the surface. And then there's the amphipod, a crustacean that can grow up to 30 centimeters long in the trench, about 10 times larger than its shallow water relatives. Its size is thought to be an adaptation to the scarcity of food in these depths, allowing it to store more energy. These organisms are all examples of life's remarkable ability to adapt to the harshest conditions. But what about the Megalodon, the largest shark that ever lived? This behemoth, estimated to have grown up to 18 meters long, ruled the oceans millions of years ago. Would the Megalodon, a creature used to warmer, shallower waters, be able to adapt to the extreme conditions of the Mariana Trench? Could it withstand the crushing pressure, the frigid temperatures, and the perpetual darkness? Or perhaps has it already done so, lurking undetected in these uncharted depths? In such extreme conditions could the Megalodon survive? As we delve deeper into the Mariana Trench, these questions continue to tantalize and intrigue us, adding to the mystery of this deep-sea enigma. Could the Megalodon with its size and power adapt to the conditions of the Mariana Trench? This is where our hypothesis takes a deep dive, quite literally. Firstly, let's consider sustenance. The Megalodon, being the ultimate apex predator of its time, primarily fed on larger prey like whales. But the Mariana Trench, the deepest part of the world's oceans, is not exactly a whale hotspot. Its inhabitants are mostly small elusive creatures that have adapted to the extreme conditions. However, occasional sightings of larger species like the giant squid provide a glimmer of hope. Could the Megalodon survive on a diet of giant squids and other deep-sea dwellers? It's a possibility. Next we delve into the extraordinary pressure exerted at these depths. The Mariana Trench goes down to more than 10,000 meters, where the pressure is over a thousand times greater than at sea level. Could a creature as large as the Megalodon withstand this? Some might argue that its massive size could actually be a disadvantage in this context. However, we've seen other sea creatures like the sperm whale dive to great depths and withstand the pressure. So it's not entirely out of the question. Thirdly, we have to factor in the frigid temperatures. 
the bottom of the trench is perpetually dark and cold, with temperatures hovering just above freezing. Yet again, life has found a way to thrive in these conditions. So it's conceivable that a megalodon with its presumably high metabolic rate could generate enough heat to survive. Finally, let's explore the concept of deep sea gigantism, a phenomenon where certain species grow significantly larger than their shallow water relatives. Could the megalodon have evolved to an even larger size in the deep sea? It's a fascinating idea but currently, it's just conjecture. In conclusion, while it's enticing to imagine a gargantuan megalodon lurking in the depths of the Mariana Trench, we must remember that it's purely hypothetical. The existence of the megalodon in the Mariana Trench remains a tantalizing mystery. The question remains, could the megalodon be hiding in the Mariana Trench? We've journeyed through the mystery of the Mariana Trench, the deepest point in our oceans, and pondered on its potential as a habitat for the megalodon, a prehistoric giant shark thought to be extinct. It's a tantalizing thought, isn't it? This massive creature, lurking in the unexplored darkness, an elusive relic of a time long past. We've discussed the unique conditions of the trench, its extreme pressure, and its frigid temperatures. Could these conditions support the life of this gargantuan beast? We've also examined the hypothesis suggesting that the megalodon could be hiding in the trench's depths. Yet despite all our speculation, our theories and our curiosity, the truth remains elusive. The megalodon in the Mariana Trench is a captivating hypothesis, but without further exploration, it remains just that, a hypothesis. Until we explore the trench further, the possibility of the megalodon's existence in its dark depths remains an intriguing mystery. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video. That's all for Nifty Narration.